Niaza Ashenafi is Ethiopia's first female Supreme Court Chief Justice. In part two of an interview here at BOA, our Ayen Biol asked her about the importance of educating women on their rights and how she developed words in Amharic language to define sexual violence. I want to talk about um, sexual harassment because mm. when you became a lawyer, you fought very hard for mm. against gender discrimination and, and, and women's rights. And mm. I'm aware that there wasn't a term for sexual harassment mm. um, in Amharic. Why was it important for you to come up with a term and to name it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, there was no term for sexual, not only sexual harassment, but there was no terminology also for violence against women until we call it tkats. And um, naming it was uh, very important. Unless you name it, it's difficult to advocate uh, for legislative reform to articulate the issue and to, um, to, to publicize and expose uh, the practice. So uh, naming was very important because then we were able to include it uh, in the law as a criminal behavior and, uh, you know, um, educate women about uh, their rights. What do you think the role of the courts is mm -hmm. um, to make sure that victims, you know, do get redress? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, the court is supposed to be impartial and uh, judges are are supposed to be impartial. They are supposed to use uh, the law, irrespective of who the party in the litigation is. But um, I'm a believer uh, in that judges have to be pragmatic also, because uh, interpreting the law, the letter of the law, mm -hmm. is one thing. But also they have to take into account, you know, the dynamics into the community. In the community, they have to understand the challenges and at the end of the day I think they have to have their eyes on mm -hmm. justice. Mm -hmm. What does justice look like for women in Ethiopia? Mm -hmm. I want them to be uh, treated uh, fairly. I want them to have the confidence that nobody is above the law. I want them to believe that our judiciary is for the poor as much as it is for the rich. So um, I, I, I want them to believe that we will have an independent and an impartial institution. Other than being a woman, yeah. what makes you different from other chief justices that mm. Ethiopia has seen? <laughs> um, well, maybe probably I'm too assertive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and... Uh, yeah, no, everybody has played their part, honestly, and um, most of them have been um, in the judiciary for a long time, and uh, probably they focused on uh, case management, uh, but uh, I, I am focusing on reform, and uh, I have a long-term view for the judiciary. That was Ethiopia's first female Supreme Court Chief Justice, Miyaza Ashenafi, speaking with BOA's Ayen Bior.